welcome to part four. A part four so important that we've given it two different names. Quo vadimus, and related to our brain metaphor, the frontal lobe. So the esteemed Oliver Wendell Holmes Jr. said, Taxes are the price we pay for civil society, and a mark of civil society is most measured in its citizens' ability to interpret and thus follow the laws set forth before them. Alas, education. Wait, Seth, you skipped Quo Vadimus. What does that mean? Oh, yeah, right. It's Latin. It means where are we going. It's from Newsroom. You should watch it. And where are we going is a really difficult question for me, let alone an expert to answer. What I keep coming back to is who do we as a state want to be? If education is going to be one of the pillars that Iowa wants to be known by, then we need to support that. If we decide that education is going to be part of the Iowa brand for the next 5, 10, or 50 years, then we need to get out of the rut of only giving a 1% increase and meet inflation and exceed inflation getting funding back into our schools. Mostly I come back to what we want to be as Iowans, what we want the rest of the nation and the world to think of us. If we want education to be part of our culture and part of our brand, it's something that we need to fund. And it's something we need to fund more than a 1% increase annually. We need to get above inflation. We need to be able to fix our schools at the same time we're modernizing our schools. We need to be able to give our students desks and technology at the same time. We need to give the students that don't speak English a fair chance in the classroom by giving them a teacher that understands them. We need to give the teachers that have incredible class sizes, sometimes in the mid-30s, a break, and we need more teachers to split that load. And I'm not even talking about additional salary for teachers. The teachers I know never make mention of salary. They talk about their classrooms and needing more time and needing more help and needing fewer students and needing better resources. When we talk about expanding funding for schools, those are the kinds of things that at least I and most others are talking about. And I think those are the kinds of things that we should be able to agree upon and to be able to increase funding to our schools for those purposes. And if we want education to be a big part of the Iowa brand, we need to be better than just being able to say, we spared cuts to K-12 again. Right? Hey, everybody, thanks for watching. Um, there was a ton that I didn't even get to get into uh, in this really four-part video. Uh, I definitely recommend going out and reading the 2016 Condition of Education report. Uh, at least skim it, look at the charts. There's a ton in there. Uh, and looking at research, uh, I got reading it and found many more questions that I had. I ended up all over the place. So I'm going to put as many of the links as I can uh, in the description notes uh, of this video uh, so you can go out and check out some of the stuff that I was looking at. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Um, if you're pro uh, additional funding uh, against it um, for what reasons what uh, uh, what makes you feel that way um, definitely want to honor your point of view I'd love to understand it it's not something I hear often thank you for watching um, next month tune in for something uh, completely different and we'll see you then thanks